Hey there guys, we're back with the Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep LP. We turned into a teleporter. Turned into a tele- No, we didn't. We transported from a teleporter. We did not turn into one. That would be... Uncomfortable to say the least. Anyways, uh... Oh hey, finish this. Finally, so we can get a map so that... We know where the fuck we're going. I still can't get over that twirl that Aqua does. Like, you really have to be so majestic when you do that. I don't know. I guess that's just... Square Enix showing off their animations. Well, they can improve it on other aspects like lip syncing. And I know this is a Japanese game, so obviously the lip syncs would be awful. But, like, if they were doing. If they were willing to do good lip syncing with a piece of shit game like Final Fantasy XIII, I don't see why can't they do it with the Kingdom Hearts. Ugh. Aloha. Must be experiment 626. I have orders to take you in. Sora! What? So this... I think okay, so it takes place after talk. Terra? I'm guessing... The the thing didn't break. I remember like one of the, It actually did break in... Uh, I think it might be Ventus. Ventus' story though, maybe. So Ventus' story took place last. That would be my guess at least. Ugh. Anyways... Here we go again. Team up with Experiment 626 uh, two, six, and defeat the Unburst. These guys are just pipsqueaks by now. Like, look at that. Two hits and a Blizzara should be enough to, like, defeat all of them. Ow. Oh, I got Kira. Not like that really matters too much, but, uh, hooray. Right, is there gonna be more? Yep, there's definitely more. Okay, I thought you were gonna attack. Come on. Oh, oh wait, I'm wearing the full health, so I don't see why I should attack, actually. No, it's good thing there's no friendly fire, because Stitch is shooting like a load of shit. Perfect. Oh, bam. HP increased as well, so that's good. I don't think like I should make it like a curve, or like anywhere next to like the max area. Whenever I'm like, I guess in the final boss, maybe I don't know. But uh, yeah, I don't want it to be as too easy as possible. Thanks. Like, I think level 35 might be too much for the final boss, at least judging from what like Terra's level for? standards. I don't remember about Vent's story or what level I was there, so maybe like 30 might be a good way Wait, place to, to fight. Because I'm level 25 right now, and by that standpoint, when I was in Terra Story, I should be, like, in that final boss area or something. Maybe a little bit, like, more grinding, and then that'll be it. Dr. Jumba hmm. and Experiment 626 have been sighted. At that time, the two of them were wandering around the launch deck. Would you see that they're secured? Is Experiment 626 really that dangerous of a creature? We must assume so. All right, then. I'll head over there now. There's probably gonna be like a wiki dictating and telling me where exactly to go, or what exactly the normalized storyline would be. Alright, this is an inaccessible area until now, so this has to be progress, right? Anyway, so, yeah. There's probably like a wiki somewhere. Uh Oh, we're supposed to go upward, okay. Which would mean we have to change the gravity of most of what's going on. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, I can't. Alright, I'll just deal with these enemies real quickly and check on my stats real quickly. Oh, now I'm in 25. Okay, so yeah, now I should be like boss battle ready, maybe? <laughs> maybe a little bit more grinding and then that'll be it, I feel. If I'm really that good of a player. Damn it. I kinda didn't want that, but okay. I'll just attack this guy so that I'll still keep up my... Yeah. Really? Okay. There we go. That's perfect way to heal up my myself. God, there's like so much enemies down here. What's going on? 
Perfect, okay. I'll fucking poison too, so I gotta be very careful. I leveled up Deep Freeze. I think Deep Freeze is... Is it level 6 or level 5 as its maximum? Magnera, oh yeah. Okay, now I have another HP boost. Uh, okay, this is finally maxed out, and so are these three. Uh, I don't think I need to max out anything else, do I? I guess I might as well. And holy shit, where the hell did I get all these arrows? Oh, no matter, I guess. It's fine to get them. And one more. Stop, okay. This could be good for, like, melding more items. I usually like to, uh... Meld, my, meld items at random and see where it goes, but I feel like HP is probably my most beneficial stat to increase, so like I'd like to have like a precise walkthrough as to how to do that. Uh, I still have one more um, blank slate area that I could do, which I can't do until I level up, I'm guessing. Three arrows, that's gonna be a mind killer. Alright, these are not that strong of a command, but I think these will do. Considering how I'm pretty strong already. Also, also, can I uh, change my shot lock? Yes, I can. Oh yeah, I also got more shot locks during the command board area, so like... I think Ragnarok and Meteor Shower I got from, uh... Playing the mini board game thing. What's it called again? The command board? Uh, I'm not uh, finished Thunderstorm yet, though, but I think Ragnar- either Ragnar- was it Ragnarok or Meteor Shower that was last time I got? It was one of these that was really good for me, because, like, they deal a lot of multiple, uh, projectiles. Bolt Blaster was fine enough, but I feel like these two are probably better, and... Yeah, I guess that's, like, a bonus for when you do, like, side stuff. Thankfully, they're not mandatory, so if you don't feel like you want to do that, then you don't necessarily have to. They're just, like, optional... Uh, bonus materials you can get if you want to do that. Uh, I think uh, the way I uh, made uh, Aqua is more of like an aerial attacker because. Oh, okay, uh, what button do I press? It didn't show me a button because the camera was. Okay, that was stupid. Yeah, if you notice, like I have a shit ton of like attacks when it comes to. Uh, going in the air like hold on let me demonstrate so this is the air attack right now that's like four attacks and that was not even like I don't think like I was even done because like I killed the enemy too early now let's try going in the uh, ground which is gonna be a little bit tough that's just three air oh no, that's still on the ground hold on no those are ground enemies so I don't think I could really do that but that's fine if I can find another air enemy I can demonstrate again Like this one. Two, three, four, five, six. Six attacks. Like, I'm definitely an aerial attacker when it comes to, like, playing as Aqua, so. Yeah. I guess in that instant, Fuckboy's gonna be a terrible, terrible move for me to do because it's ground based attack. Uh, oops, that's not what I wanted to do. So, I'm probably gonna have to change Fuckboy to something that's a lot better. Magic Pulse. I think all these are grounded, though, so. Then again, this was originally, I think, like, Surprise 1, so, by, by the way, so, there's that, um, he slash, spin attack, I think this is aerial base, so I could do that, so, I launch orbs of magic upward and knock surrounding enemies, oh, actually, no, this might be better, actually, now I think about it, so I'm gonna call you, oh, how do I rename you again? Oops, not reset name, just in case. Yeah, this was surprise one. I'm gonna rename you. Uh. So it's a launch orbs of magic towards and knock surrounding enemies into the air. So it's like an uppercut into. Wait, what? It's a projectile uppercut, I'm guessing. So I'm gonna call you. Oh, that's lowercase, oops. Oh, shit. Hado. Is there a dash? Yes, there is. Hado. I'm thinking of, like, Street Fighter here. So I was about to say Hado Shuriken, but I'm not sure if that's gonna fit. 
Hado. I guess just Ryukin is fine. You can also sometimes get creatives with these names. I don't think this is necessarily um, uh, a mandatory thing, but this is, seems obviously not a mandatory thing. But it's fun to do regardless. Okay, sure. That works. Just from the, I'm just, just from the description, that's what it looks like to me at least. One thing I really need to work on is my ground combo, so maybe if I upgrade... Uh... Yeah, it's basically... Yeah, it's... Okay, so yeah, the description's pretty much perfect there. Um, oh hey, there's that thing. Let me see if I can get to it. Oh, wait a second, of course I can get to it. Alright. Let's see here. I might need sliding dash, but I don't think I have sliding dash, do I? I should know. Never mind. I think I can make it. All right, now I have to get make sure I yeah, I'm at the very bottom. Okay, that's fine. I can always climb up back, uh, climb back up. Yeah, it's not that far of a journey, so thank God. Yeah, these enemies, I feel like you had to like fight them in the ground because the combo auto targets you onto the ground, unlike aerial enemies like these guys. So, well, of course, if they're falling down, then that's a different story. Yeah, usually like when I keep surprise, I keep it because it gives me invincibility frames so that I can think before I attack. Of course, there is a time limit though, but like, it's fine. But I feel like in this instance, I should do like more damaging attacks. And that's what Hado Ryukin does. So, oh fuck, I already leveled all the arrows. Right, that's fine and dandy. Um... HP. Maybe I should do more um, ground combo things. So hopefully I should do. Yeah, hopefully next time I meld items, I should do that. It's time to give up. Then I will fix abnormality and ridiculous behavior stops. <laughs> I like the gibberish that Stitch does. Experiment six two six. I've been authorized to take you into custody. So it really does belong to you. But where have you seen that shape? His copy he made of good luck charm that boy Terra showed to him. Terra said friend gave him charm, was very protective of it. He really said that to you? Yes. Then you're still all right, Terra. And now, because of Terra and his little bobo, my genius creation is hesitating in his genetically programmed destructive instincts. Just look at him. <laughs> but he's so adorable when he cuddles oh. with. What are you doing? Our orders are to capture them alive. I've decided to take a new approach. All right, you two. Any last words before I blast you into a million pieces? Lala Petuki. <laughs> you understand? What the hell is this? I don't know. I don't understand Stitch's language. Stop Am I gonna have to fight Gantu now? I think I'm gonna have to fight Gantu. I warned you. Stay out of it. I guess we have to do this the hard way. All right, boss battle time. Hopefully, Gantu is not as annoying as the other boss battles. Jesus Christ, it's so hot in here. So much for the drought ending. Like, California has been in the drought for a while now. Now that there's like a shit ton of rain, I thought, okay, the drought is gonna be a little bit less. No, it's fucking hot as hell now. Throw him at the enemy when he's jumping. Okay, got it. Oh shit, I don't have. Oh crap, I'm not ready. Most of these abilities are not good for. <laughs> okay. That's gonna be. Not only that, but I should have, uh. Shit. That's not a good idea, what are we doing? Oh, fuck. Oh, there's only five of them. There we go. Oh, it does a shit ton, though. God, even at its max, it doesn't seem like it's a good... Alright. That doesn't seem like a good heal, but... I'll take that for now, I guess. Shit. Okay, I do have invincibility frames, it's just that I can't really control them. What are you trying to gain here from doing that, Gantu? Also, uh... Stitch, where are you? I forgot, you're jumping, so... 
I should probably demonstrate your attack, huh? Uh, you're not jumping anymore, and I think I glitched you. Whoops. Alright, thanks for the heal, but asshole. Because he's... Yeah, he's almost dead, so... You know what, Stitch, I'll let you have the finishing blow, because... Because it seems like you deserve it. Come on, Stitch. Wow! His grab... Ooh! There we go. Tch! <laughs> That doesn't damage him, does it? Yeah, that's more like a punish, if anything. Uh, so yeah, I think I might have, again, went a little bit overboard with the grinding as well. Because, well then again, like, that battle in itself doesn't seem like it's that bad. Like, it's simple enough so that you could, like, deal with it. I'd say, I kinda, but I feel like at the same time... <coughs> Seems like it's easier than Vanita's Enough. boss battle on Aqua. I observed battle. everything on the monitor. I, I can explain. <laughs> nice going, Gantu, you idiot. You've been of great service, Aqua. Thank you. Hmm. <sighs> Captain Gantu, escort 626 to the asteroid to which he's been banished. When you return, you're back on patrol. Not patrol. <laughs> That's what you get for not following commands and shit. Please, your highness. Would you consider sparing experiment 626? Spare him? He's an extremely dangerous creature. I cannot release such a menace. But it seems to me he's at least trying to make friends. And dangerous or not, I really believe he can succeed. Very well, Aqua. If he behaves himself, I will consider shortening his exit. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> I like the charm you made. Do you think maybe my circle of friends could become part of yours? My name is Aqua. My friends are Terra and Ventus. Aqua. Terra. Who the fuck's the voice actor for Stitch? He's so adorable. I need to look that up, Maeve. Definitely. Like, he's a threatening creature if you, like, piss him off, but Jesus Christ, is he so adorable. Yay, got a D-Link. Uh, oh yeah, a Keyblade. I forgot. I could also switch Keyblades if I want to. Like for some reason, I keep on thinking of like one of the gorillas, the, the band members for gorillas voicing him or something. Like I imagine, like, is it Two B his name or something? Like the the vocalist for uh, for uh, gorillas. Murdoch's the bassist. I think Two B is the is the uh, the vocalist. Is, well, no, I think Murdoch's the drummer. Actually, now I think about it. no, it's I don't know. Murdoch's either the drummer or the bassist. Noodles, the guitarist. I think 2B is the vocalist. Yeah, for some reason I'm just reminded of him whenever I think of whenever I'm thinking of uh, voice actors that sound like I'm. I don't think it's him, but like if it is him, I kind of wouldn't be surprised. Uh, Neverland will be our next destination, so stay tuned for the next episode of Kingdom Hearts: Birth by Sleep. Stay tuned.